Hello friends, Matt here with Woe Quotes. Don't forget to subscribe. Today the quote comes from St. Thomas More, and it goes like this. One of the greatest problems of our time is that many are schooled, but few are educated. Now, St. Thomas More wrote this back in the 1500s, and if it was true then, it's certainly true now. The whole idea of this difference between schooling and education is this. Schooling is going to school, getting information, you know, maybe learning some facts, and that's about it, or picking up some skills. But education, to St. Thomas More, and as it should mean, is something more than that. Education comes from the Latin prefix ex, or e, like the word exit, which means out, and then the Latin word ducere, which means to lead. So education is being led out, and it's being led out from ignorance. This whole idea that we are coming out of ourselves and being led into the truth of reality, into wisdom. We're learning how to think for ourselves, how to think critically about things, and for our mind to become the very best that it can be. Even in modern times, education is usually just seen as a means to some end. We go to school so that we can go to college and then get a good job, and that's it. We should be using the tools we have to hone our minds to be the very best that they can be, so that we can become truly educated, let out, and learn to become wise, critical thinkers, and knowers of wisdom and lovers of wisdom, instead of just having skills. Brief biographical note, there was a movie made about St. Thomas More called A Man for All Seasons. I highly recommend it. And he actually lost his life. He was killed because he wouldn't go along with the new edicts of the king to follow him and his religion. So he's not the first person to have lost his life for uh, thinking critically for himself and loving the wisdom that he had. So don't forget to subscribe and then click to receive notifications and I'll put up a new video with a new quote every Wednesday and Saturday. Thanks for watching.